I think he always check raises... Mate, is this going to be the worst call I've ever made here? Yeah. I think he always check raises king nine. I think he check raises king queen. I don't think he overbets king jack, but it'll be an excellent bet if he overbets king jack. So we're looking at specifically king five suited two combos. Okay, well, you get the fucking good ragtag taken away from you, don't you, you absolute spanner? Please, if you hit this guy, hang on. Please don't type Keck W. This guy has said three messages in this stream. One of them is, please don't type Keck W, Keck w annoying emote. You can have three minutes to think about what you've done. Oh my god, this guy's a fucking stain. Oh my god, this guy's an actual stain. Oh my god, am I actually just gonna fold? I don't think I can fold. Green of spades. All right, we're super protected here anyway now, so that's cool. Like, our only hands are jacks, queens, kings, aces, and I guess ace, kings suited. But... So, like, uh, we, we can't bet for value here um, against what I assume is in very, very nitty uh, cold fallback range, because I think his cold fallback range consists of specifically, like, queens plus an ace king. Um, we could bet really small to protect, but... I don't know how good that is, and we're it's even we're mega protected. Not that we actually have tens, because I fold tens pre, but he might not know that. Uh, we need to see his king here. Yeah. Nice. So like his range will just be like we should bet that turn very small one because we can protect against hands like ace king, but we can also get value from hands like king jack suited, which at a low frequency wants to do that, or ace jack suited. But he's not going to have those hands, so our, our our bet doesn't make sense as a as a value bet. So I will be playing some off stream, but. Uh, this is that guy that, that uh, check raised the, the, the queen 10, uh, that raised the queen 10 earlier. So I don't really know what to, what to think of him. He's either a very... I don't even like the raise because I'm not really going to call with, with worse. Uh, call in flop, call in turn, and then fold him rivet here. Um, with no club, and obviously we can fold rivet because we have a shitload of ASX. Jack is bad, because when he checks, he's going to have some Jack X of clubs. This is kind of actually weird to see, this line and this sizing. Just because there's not really many hands that want to do this. Like, he doesn't want to do this with, like, Ace-4. We block Ace-10. I guess Ace-Queen, specifically. The thing is, we just don't need to call 10s. If we have... We can have 5s, 9s, Jacks, Ace, Jack, Ace, King, Ace, Queen, Ace, 10... Um, we can have so much shit. Why are you betting so big here, buddy? We're gonna raise him. So it's kind of, kind of weird, but like... Uh, I don't know if I can go for it all here, but we're gonna go for an overbet on this turn. Yeah, we're gonna try and... I might try and go for it all on the left. I rolled a 98 anyway, so... Don't think... Pink tags... It's just, you can't get worse wherever the king of spades. We don't win, though. We beat ace-queen. And he's just going to have ace-king like, every fucking time. Oh, wow. ace fat! What a horrible, horrible river that was. Fuck me. Just brick one time, you shitbag. Uh, I've rolled high. I just want a fucking three bet. I don't know if we even three bet this hand some like sometimes, but I I'm feeling sick at my 2% three bet, so I'm going to three bet. Do I call a four bet, though? I guess I don't. I don't really three bet this a lot, to be honest. Um, I think we want to bet this flop. Um, half part or big bets are absolutely fine here. This is going to be a double for sure. Um, yeah, we're doubling. I might have to triple, I don't know. Block nines and tens, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Probably just all in if we have ten eye by the river. If it comes a club, I might check. Yeah, we're all in. Um, so we at least block 10 jack of clubs. The good thing with the turn being a deuce as well is that you can still have like fives and threes here, um, which are going to call flop and call turn if they call a three bet. Um, we also unblock hands like ace queen of clubs. The jack, he can have some jack extra clubs, which is shit, but we block some of those. And we've got fucking 10 high, lads. Like, I'm not going to check, am I? Nice. All our bluffs are getting through today as well. You'd love to see it. 
I'm, I'm on a... Well, no, I'm not on a... No, I'm on a high roll, so I'm going to burn. No, I'm going to check back. I want, I want to check back here. I want to check back and just have some 10 jacks because I don't think he... I, I think he'll be the kind of player that will just never believe that I have 10 jack because I check back the flop. Uh, I guess we'll do pot bets because our value probably wants to bet really big now that we've checked back. I can probably have some small bets as well. I don't know. Uh, seven's weird. I'm going to bet small and then defend to a raise here. Uh, just, I want to give this guy room. If he has a flush, it's absolutely disgraceful. I was going to say, just don't go all in. That'd fucking really suck. 10-4? Okay, so that, that guy does just click buttons then. Uh, Ace Jack, I have no idea if we want to raise, but we have done. I guess this. Maybe we could even check. I don't even know if we want to raise the flop. King 10 suited, I'm going to use the 4 bet. So I'm going to 4 bet. Ah, the 4 of spades. <laughs> That's not ideal. Uh, this is kind of ideal, though. Um, I guess, like, relatively big bet. So I guess we can go half pot here and then probably shove turn. I'm going to check this river, and I need it to go check, check. He has all the ace of spades. So he can't value bet worse. Can't really turn, like, Jack Queen of Hearts into a bluff. Maybe 10x of Hearts? Like, Queen 10 of Hearts that would bluff River? Because, like, Queen 10 half has to fold. Uh, we can chop here. In fact, I think the most likely outcome is that we chop when he bets this small size. He should bet bigger with flushes unless he's just super greedy. Yeah, chop, which is obvious. People do that. They, 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 um... They play the hands like face up, basically, you know? So, like, he's basically saying, I have ace jack, and then they just always tend to have ace jack. We could all time you out now, Carl. We, could, we can just mix between. What do you mean, min click? We're not having that, son. We're not having that, son. 16 and a half big blinds to go, sir. Ah, oh, this guy's just megaphoning it. Should we should we should we re-megaphone? <laughs> Please don't fold. I bet you've got aces, haven't you? He's just literally min clicked it twice. We're gonna we're gonna have some fun here. We should probably actually call in case he's surely he's not actually capable of doing this with shit. Uh, so we go, <laughs> we go post flop in a five bet pot. <gasps> we really don't need to bet big at all here. That was, <laughs> that was a weird hand. In a bit more of an adult. Um, so we get megaphoned here from a pink tag with the min click pre. We flop top pair and we're going to have a hard time. Just give us a jack or a king. Well, yeah, but not one that's a heart. So I'm going to lead this because I expect his, like, if his ace, king, or ace is checked back, it's disastrous. And same again on the river. Um, I'm just going to go this size because I will expect a lot of fish to uh, never fold aces or ace, king. Um, I also don't think people will bluff that ace, queen with a heart as often as they should. So we're just going to bet big and get the snap fold, <laughs> flop in the nuts with <laughs> the 7 8. <laughs> Getting bet into on a board that's probably a range check. This guy C bets 93% though, so I can have just all kinds of nonsense on this board. Calls, we still have the nuts on the turn. Definitely big bets on this turn because our value wants to bet big because our value is sets and straights. And we have a straight. So we're going to bet pot on the turn and then we're going to go all in on the river if it's a nice one. Would you be a nice river? Jack of red would be pretty cool. Uh, the eight's obviously a bit shit, but he doesn't have any hands that are better than us, theoretically. Um, if we ever have any bluffs, fuck knows what they are going to be now. We would have to do something like this with threes, which we're probably not doing. We could even bet small um, just to try and actually target like over pairs here because they should definitely be folding now. But just in, I don't know, in the hope. He probably never has sets because sets are just going to check jam. So I think he's just going to fold a lot here. 
But with a pink tag, just in case he's entitlement tilt calls aces. Oh, wow. He had fucking a set of sixes. Oh, my God. <laughs> Get in the bin. <laughs> Easy. Why do we sun run? Think about this. The second the fucking challenge is over, we started absolutely just pounding everybody. It's going to be scary here. Three betting ace king this deep against an orange tag. I kind of want to just fold, but I can't in position, which really sucks. I'm not going to play any five bets here. Oh my god. <laughs> Danger! Alright, sweet. Ace! <laughs> Ace on the river! Dealer, please! I mean, I'm not going to get stuck because I'll fold river, but ace on the river. Okay, we're protected here. Um, he shouldn't really have that many flushes either. We will definitely have more flushes than he will. I guess kings with a heart can still shove. All right, check, check. I need to chop. Yeah, it's so fucking dumb. I should just fold pre-man. Like, every time I'm deep, I end up in a spot. The river's not saved us because we fold the river anyway, but ace, king, queen, and a four-bet pot, man. We'd have to have the king of hearts. To have the king of hearts, we either have a flush or we have ace, king. Uh, here, I think I'm going to go for the check raise with king jack. I might just blast it off. Yeah, we're going to go for the check raise here. I think that's a pretty reasonable candidate wrapping around the queen. Loads of good cards we can pick up. We block some top pairs. And if it like bricks out, we'd unblock like a lot of like draws and potential combo draws. So we'd just end up blasting it. 10 9, we flop top two. And he bets pot. We're just going to raise massive and then shove turn if he's going to pot. Uh, assuming the turn is a brick. Give us the three of hearts on the turn. Or, you know, give us, uh, give us one of the worst turns in the deck. I guess block. And absolutely sigh if we get raised. I think his aces and stuff just call, so... Oh my god, what a fucking stain. Also, what a fucking stupid turn card! Uh, check call in the 8-9, not being happy with it. I think we, sh we should call turn. Uh, we unblock all the queen tan, king queen, spades. Block some two pairs. I'm going to call turn and then I might have to fold river. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to fold this river because it's actually a bad river. I guess it's bad that like... So he doesn't bet jack six anymore. Can, can he value bet worse is the question. I don't think so. So I'm going to fold. So like, what's he? Queen eight is probably just not going to do this now. Seven five gets there. Queen ten gets there. Ten eight would be a good bluff. But we block that. So his value on flop is going to be jack nine sixes. Really is going to drill this with king queen. Or King Tan. This is... Uh, we should actually call here. Uh, what's he saying on River? Against an unknown, I'm going to call. I wish I had more time to think about that. Queen Tan. I was right on the turn and then wrong on the river. I should fold the river because nobody bluffs the river. I keep doing this, man. Really pissing me off. Really, really pissing me off. Also pissed off that I only have 20 seconds to think about that as well. Oh my god, I have flopped a straight flush. <laughs> Is it going to be one of those days? Like, <laughs> Nick, I really hope he raids me now. <laughs> He'd be so tilted. I might take my fucking time with his hand. Nah, he, he, might be going, he might be continuing for another 20 minutes or so. I mean, I'm just going to have to raise. I mean, I'm on a 97 roll as well. You can have higher flushes. You can have the Ace of Diamonds, all sats, stuff like that. Uh, do we just want to bat and then shove River? I guess so. It feels it, like because we have absolutely zero to protect from, so it, f it feels kind of bad almost. Like check raise bat shoving, because it's so horrible when they fold. So maybe we could check that hand. Yeah, it seems kind of splashy, so we'll call the three bat here with ten jack suited. 
and instantly hate life. Uh, continuing, I'm not sure if we ever want to raise. We did roll high, but I don't know how often we want to raise on this board. This is a small size. It's probably okay, to be honest. I'm going to call flop, call turn, and then probably fold river. If he bats, actually, if he bats massive, I'll consider just fold and turn. Because there's not really much where, like, yeah, I'm just going to fold here. Even though his overbat doesn't really make much sense in terms of value. Just because he doesn't need to overbat aces or kings to get the money in smoothly. So it's generally going to be weaker, I think. But against a complete unknown. Um, the stainiest reg in the pool, cold four bets here. I, I, I wonder if I have to just go with this because I think he's going to have ace king quite often with this size. I really want to see if I can find out a spot where we actually just look at if this is just queens, ace, king, aces. Like, surely it's just an all in if he has all combos of ace, king as well, right? <laughs> well, I guess we won't be doing that again. Oh my god. Another <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you, son. <laughs> nice. I mean, we're going to go all in again, again against the fucking nit rag. If we just two outed somebody out of nowhere. And we fade the snap here as well. Okay. Ace king or jack? Ace or a king? Okay. I uh, can't really complain there, uh, to be honest. He should probably fold in that sp Um I mean, I should probably fold jacks in that spot, but... How do you take that long to fucking 3-bat as well? It makes me so tilted. He's literally just taken 30 seconds to 3-bat. We'll take, we'll take 30 seconds to fold. Only 3-bat part against Max Skew. The ace-queen suited. And if you've got an overpass on, you win it all. There you go. Waste your time, mate. Tier 4, obviously. I wonder if you ever want to raise this. Versus a third. Bit annoying that there was a four there. I should have just known when we rolled a four. Uh, I don't know if we want to shove this turn ever with this combo. Do we have shoves? I don't know if we have shoves. A really interesting hand. So, Maka will have some 6-7 suiteds, uh, and then he's got aces and kings, but we're not folding ace queen. Ever. If he has some, like... Don't know what he wants to shove as a bluff here. Seems about right. Counterintuitive to bluff on that kind of board, because... Like two flush draws missed, you don't really have anything that wants to bet the flop and turn that then wants to bet the river, like as a bluff. Because like most of the hands are gonna have you're gonna have either um, hearts or clubs or whatever the the thing it was. Uh, I could raise here versus this size. We'll just call. Picking back here. Just uh, bet big with aces, sladdy. I'm going to have to raise versus that size. I'm not, um, but it's thin. Sweet. Um, we'll see once I've got more in my ACR account. I can't be asked doing it now because I might have to reload and I can't be bothered. Well, I'm going to set a fours. I will check. We'll go for the chat raise, yeah. Seeing as there's two players left. If there was one player left and two here, like if both blinds are called, I would definitely um, bat because there's less chance we can check raise. Um, we're just going to make it massive here. Plus, they're going to be combo draws that want to make it really big. We have the nuts here unless this guy flats jacks, which would be grim. Have, I guess Ace Jack. I <laughs> really want him to have something that's just dead. Have Ace King. Have like Ace King of Hearts. Like, I've seen shit like Ace King hit like this before. What are you all in for? Hold. Hold. Yeah, boy. Look at that. 300. That's the biggest part we fucking won at 50. <laughs> 
Hmm, Philip Ivy, how many hands do you have on the villain in question, out of interest? Do you see his stats? Because I can see his stats. I don't think you can, buddy. Uh, Calling the three about these ten of diamonds. This guy seems pretty splashy, but not many hands. Uh, how about the ten of hearts? I don't think we ever want to shove this on turn. Ace Jack probably would. Because uh, we... Like, we can get called by worse with Ace Jack with Ace 10, we can't, but we're probably not folding here. Thing is, I need it to be an absolute brick on the river. Most likely hands for value are kings and queens here. Uh, he's playing 57-43, only in, like, a very limited number of hands. And then, yeah, just fall any check, because I'm not folding on this river with this price, and we're never shoving for value, so... Nice! I, lo I love the call any chat call, man. It's so much fun. Uh, Jack's are going to 3-bet and very reluctantly 5-bet shove. Okay. Queen Abbott's pretty good for us, I think. Uh, I guess this hand wants to check, though, a lot. So we will check. Against our friend 33% uh, Pot Blaster. <gasps> Um, King definitely protects us. Can I do anything daft here, like 10% pot? I'm gonna try it. I wonder if this is a thing. This might absolutely not be a thing. We're probably betting bigger, but like, Jax doesn't want to bet bigger. We should be good. Okay. I'm gonna flat here, even though we're getting a really bad price against the fish. 3x pot. Kinda wanna call. I wish we had... I mean, we can't call this. Really want it, though. Uh, I'm just going to raise, get this in against this stack here. So, like, if he has something like jacks or queens, we are flipping or ahead, and we have fold equity against some better hands. Um, ace or a red, please deal it. That is a red. Easy game. This guy's been 3 ban a lot. Ugh. I'm not super thrilled at this. I am going to call, though, this time on a higher roll. And this is a very good board for us because we have all the sets. Probably pure. Although I don't always call sixes, but sevens and tens I'm basically always calling. So he, su he should be pretty simmered on this flop. But, you know, everyone just range bats one third. Give us a ten of hearts. Okay. So now you should definitely simmer down a hell of a lot here. Uh, we're going to bet a quarter part. It will protect against hands like ace-king, um, ace-queen. Um, we have sets that want to bet like this. Uh, low roll here. We'll check call the ace-queen. We're super protected because we have, like, straights. We have... I wonder what we want to bluff with on the river. Do we have to bluff this hand? Uh, obviously chat raised in the river here. I don't think he's going to call his 10x and stuff anyway, so. What worse hands do I even have? Uh, we're just going to try and target a flush. We're just going to go fucking massive. Probably should actually just go all in here, but. Can I get aces? He can definitely have queens as well. We block jacks, which is a bad... What the fuck do I want to bluff here with? I think this is probably be a bluff, because I actually don't know how many worse hands we're going to have. Oh, wow, that's well unfortunate. Uh, I wasn't expecting a hand like that. Shit, that definitely folds. I think we should bluff that river. But the thing is, like, so many times I I've shoved in spots, and, and at these stakes, I've just seen people call down with aces and kings. Normally, when I have value on, on a board like that, normally when I have value, uh, I really think we should bluff that river, though. Uh, I wasn't expecting to see many hands like that. I forgot about hands like that, so... It's a super, super interesting spot. I really think we should bluff that hand. But it's so tilting if he just fucking calls aces anyway. Alright, don't put fucking KKK at the end of my name. Jesus. Uh, call call here against Macro, I guess. Or do I want to fold this hand? What better hands do we have? I don't know if I want the nine. He has very few 3x. I think we'll probably... 
I don't think he's gonna bluff clubs and stuff all that often. I guess maybe like four or five of clubs. I guess we'll call, but I'm not I'm not exactly fucking thrilled about it, to be honest. We don't have that many better hands. Be the Queen 8, which is nice. Nice try, Maka. Queens are gonna open the button. Maka in the small blind, that is good news for us. Because he's gonna three bet a lot. And we're gonna four bet. I wonder if we ever flat this hand. Rob's not. Flipping! Maka stacks us before, hold it. How about another seven? Or is that too greedy? Oh, he's unlucky, Maka. To be fair, I wasn't even going to be pissed off if you'd have won that hand. Because if you'd have won that hand, I would have been like, you know what, I'd rather, if I'm going to lose a flip, I'd rather lose it to Maka than anyone else in the pool, so. Why would you tank there? Why would you bet that big just to think about it, like calling the show? If you bet to call or you bet to fold, like you're bluffing or value betting. You guys got 3%, 1% 3-bet, uh, sorry, so we'll uh, bet range. Uh, open range, sorry. I'm going to bet flop and bet basically every turn on the left. Yep. Uh, this guy could have sets, which is suck after limp calling. I might even end up folding here, no cap. I'm going to have to give up. Ooh! King of clubs! King Jack and he checked back. Oh my god, that guy's such a fucking nit. I really just want to just want to bang this in. I'm going to do this, and I know it's so stupid, but I think they just have sets. They're playing 8 8 0. God, if they fold, it's so dumb. I think they call the flush throws right. They've just got a set right. Or Jack 6, even better. Woo! Nice. Fucking swingy day, boys. The swingiest of days. Picking up the aces. On Silver Stacker, get it in, son. Ugh. Do I want to check or do I just want to? Okay, now we play for stacks then. Just trying to get it all in on this flop. Uh, turn the nuts over here. Very safe turn as well. I uh, don't think I want to have over bats, but I would definitely want big bats. Just don't shove like 10-9. Uh, And then overbet in this river on the right hand side. Bluffs are going to be King Jack, King Turn. 10 9. A6 off. Oh my fucking god. What on earth is that, man? Holy fucking shit. So dumb. 93%. Call here at least, Major Fish. Have Ace 8 of Hearts. I was enjoying today until that. Got to fold there as well. This guy's pretty nitty. Maybe over betting's bad, like, exploitatively. I think we should just bet smaller. Maybe bet pot. He might even fold two pairs there. Hmm, shit flop for eights. Jax will just four bet shove. This guy's fucking four bet king eight suited under the gun before. Uh, we're on a high roll as well, so we're just going to shove. Snap by kings, obviously. Can we hit a jack? Come on, man. Fucking such nonsense hands. I, um, so 61, 80. I think we're not deep enough to call this because of how nutted he's going to be. Play 19, 17, 8. 5% 4-bet. His 4-bet range has only been kings. I think we have to fold. We were 200, if we were over 200 deep, I would have called. Check raised here, low roll, so we'll just call. I think three bet in here is absolutely fine. Could be a good turn, <laughs> unless he's got pocket threes. This guy's tagged as a net as well. Um, yeah, we'll just do this and then shove over. Wasn't me, Slim Shady said to do it again. Have seven five suited. Ugh, does he have six axe? I mean, he might, but I guess we just shove anyway, right? This sucks, though. Yeah, 
So we fade the snap. Can I go for three streets with King Queen? Probably not. King Jack specifically. I think Ace 10 just falls. Nice. Fucking hell. Sevens. Okay. <laughs> you block the straight, but you don't want to block the straight at that point. Okay, so this guy just doesn't like to fold. Now, if I sell at 2.0, do you think I'd sell 1%? <laughs> Uh, I think actually calling this turn, blocking ace king. We don't block king queen though, actually. Don't make me call the river. Okay, should protect us. But then, like, no, I guess, like, uh, I think some of his ace 10 and, like, I think people like to check raise these boards a lot with flush draws, so I guess we definitely won't be calling this river, but. I don't want to call. Bit sketch, but I'm going to bet this turn. And check river, obviously. If you lead, I'm going to have to call. Yeah. Block King Jack. Queen X doesn't want to do this. Maybe Queen 10. Diamonds missed. Um, fish. Psy call. Nice. Jack 7. I'm going to check back the Jack. Uh, we are going to squeeze here with the Ace-King. I'm going to call Tenjak on the turn. And Psy call River, I think. Go check and beat the pocket fours. Smack it with the call. Okay. Uh, super small bats here, I think is fine. Uh, I think I'm going to bet aces and kings on this turn, but not ace-king. He doesn't really have many flushes on the turn, um, with the exception of, like, jacks with a spade. I might try this fucking one-tenth part again. Uh, we're all in here with kings. Wow, 4-bet folded, playing 19-4-7. Zero. Uh, so we will have some flushes, so we will have some hands that want to raise. He's got ace five. Oh, fucking hell. What a shit turn, man. How are you not four betting ace five suited? I'm just going to play calls. How is it? How have we not won like so much more? <laughs> that's what's that's what's happening today, chat. Keep it. Keep it nice and zen. This guy is a joke. There's a lot of jokes in the pool today. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Nah. I'm not. Am I? Nah, nah. You can, you can, have, you can have queens. Of course you can have queens. Alright, no snap's good. You're not going to fall back fold. Of 58 big blinds. <laughs> oh my god. What do you mean? That's the first time he's fall back in 300 hands. He's got 90% fold to 3 bet. 90 and 0% 4 bet. He's playing 19-14-4. Fucking hell. Imagine me folding there. Oh my god. Holy shit. I do like free money. Looking at, looking at you there. Jack. Jackie boy. Took fucking so long to do it. Do you know what? I'm going to call. I was on a high roll anyway. But I just figured that I'd flop top set. To be quite honest with you. Figured I'd flop top set. Pretty nice when you flop top set. Even better when they dunk pot into you. Oh my god. I actually think I might just raise. Didn't raise. I knew it I knew it wouldn't be a safe turn. Mose, what's going on? Thank you very much for the uh, two months, my dude. Let me figure out what I'm doing here. I'm gonna call a I just bang it and now he's overpowered. Call. He might have a flush here though, with the sizing on the flop. He folds and overpair now. If he has overpair, no spade, he might fold. Should just raise the flop. Uh, here, I guess we fold. Come on, thank you very much for two months, man. I appreciate it. Oh my god. Come on, not don't do this, man. Not when I'm in a fucking foul mood. Set over set. Fucking hell. Probably even three about tens, to be honest. 
Doesn't matter what I do, if I raise the flop, it goes in anyway, so he's not going to fold unless I make it egregious and, and force him to fold, which I'm not going to do because I have top set. What a fucking horrible turn. Jesus Christ, man. Suck me off, man, man. You're bad. Oh, we're going to be all in on fucking everywhere here. Yeah, we're not all in there. I would check him back. This guy's a fucking joke as well. Never seen him. Never seen him bet a river that isn't just pure value, but still has like reg stats. Like is a reg, but just had a disgusting cooler the other day against him. This is actually thin. Have king jack of spades because that has to call. Plus, they're going to have to be pocket tans, which would suck. Fucking hell. I, I don't want this amount of good hands. <laughs> just simmer down a lot. I'm just going to raise and get this in, I think. Against the fish. Yeah, just shove and turn on such a wet board. Last second call? Nope. I'm just going to check. I don't think he's going to fold his 8s, 9s, stuff like that. Tans. Do you grind 50 off the stream any particular reason? Just fancied it. Just thought I'd... Uh... I'm going to check back against this guy. I just thought I would... Um... I would barrel off on this king turn. This guy's such a whale, he might even call like sixes on the turn. <sighs> you can have worse though. You can have ace 10 and 10 jack and 10 9. <laughs> Love to see it, man. Soul read him. I knew I had showdown there, boys. I knew I had showdown. What hand? I can't remember. I'm way too tired, man. I got aces though. Can you tell me what hand? 12 big blinds to go, sir. Come on, Mondero, stick it in. Come on, Higmo, stick it in. Come well, on, I'm putting that fourth bat. What do you mean, call? All right, we're going to be all in here. Most likely. Do I want to bat the turn or do anything like check shove? Well, low. I think I'll go for the check shove here. I think people will try and bet small with uh, uh, like eights and nines and stuff like that as well. He's got a set. He's got a set. It wouldn't be nice if he has a set. It's actually probably a better hand to call rather than shove, but I'm just sticking it in. Hold. Oh, nice. And that's why we stick it in, because otherwise it goes check check on the river. I put him on 10 jack of spades, boys. I'm the greatest player the world has ever seen. All right, we flopped a straight flush draw. A draw to a straight flush. The queen of clubs will give us a straight flush. So if you want to be the queen of clubs on the turn, dealer, we'll be okay with that. Actually, the queen of hearts would be better, to be honest with you. But... Uh, King will take... Um, we are going to bet big on this turn. Blocking Queen Jack's really useful here. Um, we also have an easy bet call if we do get raised, even if we think he's only raising really strong hands. I don't think hands like King 9 will check raise. King 10 probably won't either. We should get to realize equity. On a high roll here, we will bet. I'm pretty sure this is a mix with 8s with a diamond, and without a diamond, it's just going to check. And then it might end up bluffing on diamonds. Uh, am I all in here? Might have to be all in here. I'm not really fucking buzzing about it, though. No, I'm not going to be all in. I'm going to give up on the river. Fuck me. What is this size, man? Are you going to make me fold King Jack? I guess I can't. Just be a club just to fucking punish him for this. This is disgusting. Club. Fuck me, man. What an absolute buffoon. Oh my god, I drilled an eight. Shit, if he's got a flush, he's got a flush here. Oh my god, it'd be so dumb if he's got a flush as well. 
Because it's such a stupid river. No snap, but we could be getting rolled. Out of nines, he shouldn't have jacks, so we should be good. Just call ace jack. Or ace queen with the with a diamond. King jack hammer is so dumb. I actually should have folded. Oh my god. <laughs> what out did you little fucker? Get in the bin. <laughs> well, let's drill a nine ball corner pocket. Did your raid work? Oh my god, that is a full house. Oh my god, have a five, noob. Hello, Godhand. I didn't see the raid, but thanks for the... Oh, shit, yeah, yeah, Pumplex, thank you for the raid, sorry. Hello, Godhand. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do some checking here. Sounds like you're the salty one, lol. I don't even know if you're talking to me, but I'm gonna give you a three-minute timeout anyway. Just, just, just in case. Just... Oh, my God, what the fuck is going on here? I knew it was gonna be a five. This guy could literally have quads. Okay, well, we win. I mean, there's no way you're going to have, like, an overpower, right? Unless you have specifically aces. I'm wondering if I can call to get him to overcall rather than shove. But I guess that, like, Mini Bobini just has aces. He could have a five here, and he would probably roll with a five, so... Oh, you love to see it, man. Holy shit. Fucking drilling it left, right, and center. Can't believe it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy 1%. Oh, is that you, Hell Kid? Sorry, buddy. Unlucky, man. <laughs> that was fucking dirty. To be fair, though, you probably fold on Brick Rivers and I shove on Brick Rivers. Not that that's any consolation because you lose less, but... <laughs> I'm gonna win that hand an awful lot. But getting one out, it's pretty fucking disgusting. Can't believe I'm gonna buy 1% of Calthor. Oh, my God. Literally wailing it off. Uh, against this whale, I'm going to call. I might call River as well. It's actually not an unreasonable combo. We unblock hands like 7-9, um, 10-9, 7-X diamonds. Um, and I don't think he bets this with a 6. So we're looking at like 8-X and better. Like, so I actually think this is a really good hand to call down with. Jack 5. Beat the ace 10. Love to see it. Easy game. To be honest, I just knew I was gonna. Uh, I just knew I was gonna drill a one out, so I thought, it "Fucking doesn't matter, doesn't it?" Uh, I'm just gonna blast this off. I think on the right because I don't think he's gonna have King Jack. Uh, yeah, I think he's gonna have a lot of Ace Jack and Ace Kings here. I guess my value wants to pot. Can I? No, I guess I can do this because I can bet some 10x for this size. I can bet ace 10 for this size. Ace 10 calls and we lose to ace 10, but um, I'm actually going to bet this turn against Echo. Fucking 9 10 is really good. He's going to have some 8x that continues, 10 8, stuff like that. Queen should be relatively irrelevant other than a few combos of queen 8 suited. We get called by queen 8. <laughs> Look how long he fucking took to call with queens, with a queen there. Where about that? So, like, you're not like, what What was he thinking of? Was he thinking of folding? Child. Picking up the aces. Do, do, do. Bang at this. Go on, fucking four bet me. Playing 17, 13, 6. Yeah, I didn't think so, mate. Didn't think so, buddy. Uh, with this SPR, probably just going to go for it all. What, one combo of ace 10 suited? It's something. Do I want to check the turn? I don't know. It depends on what the turn is. don't really want to see a 9. Doon, 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 doon. Yeah, I guess we can, I guess, I guess we can just do this and then, and then show the rivers. Megaphone min raise. Shit. I have 9s. I'm not folding this, but he will. So I don't think he's ever going to have a full house, but he will have some 10x. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to get raised at any point. The guy just fucking goes all in with threes. Uh, shit, just a cool of that, boys. I'm always curious about little spots. Picking up the aces. Picking up the aces. Picking up the aces. And picking up the chips, by the looks of things. Oh, this, guy, this guy's got a pretty high four bet. You know you want to four bet me. Oh, yeah, things you love to see. So we're just going to call here to protect our uh, worst hands. 
that we don't just get run over by four bets. How about a nice deuce, deuce three? King, eight, seven. Could be good, could be bad. I don't think he's going to have sevens and eights, although you never know. And kings is the only hand we lose to now. And he can have ace, king, which is good. It's a bit of a shame when he has queens, but... What do you mean, check? We're going to carry on being passive and check back. Nine, he could have nines. But I think he probably bats flop. He's probably just got kings here, by the way. Uh, we'll take the ace of hearts. We take the ace of hearts. I mean, as far as, far as rivers go, like, it's a pretty fucking good one. We're only beaten by kings, and I don't think he should have any 7x, so kings and nines. You got kings, haven't you? Ooh, nice. Nice! So the first one was this fucking punt off with jacks. The thing is, it's going to be, I don't know, it's probably kind of not really GTO. Cut off opens, button calls. We squeeze jacks, which we're doing pure. Then a big blind, four bets. And then we just decide to bang it in with jacks. Okay. So the jacks, th theoretically, isn't a massive punt off, but the guy's a nit. But the thing is, he will have all of the combos of aces, uh, ace king. Right? So he has all combos of ace king. Even if we take out... I mean, surely jacks doesn't matter against these, because then we block these. So if anything, his range is stronger. So... But he won't have ace queen off. That's the only problem. And he won't have nines, eights, or fucking king five suited, will he? Let's have a look at this one. This was the one against Mako where he stacks us. This was a super interesting hand. So we open the cut off. Um, the big blind three bets with this range. And Mako will have some shit that isn't just nutted hands. Or so he says. Uh, we're going to call his queen suited. We're just doing that pure, right? Queen, seven, seven. Um, big blind C bets or small, I would imagine. Yeah, always betting kings as well. 50% or a third is fine. Let's say that's a third. We are raising sometimes with ace queen suit. That makes sense. Turn five of hearts. Villain bets big. Kings is always betting big, which makes sense. And do we have a shove with this hand? Occasionally, yeah. Actually, it's just mixing. It's fine either way with spades. Hearts never doing it for obvious reasons. Uh, so we call. And what was the river? It was like a total brick. Let's see what villain's supposed to shove with his bluffs. So he's pure shoving kings, checking aces sometimes, shoving king queen off, which Mac is just not going to do because I'm not going to call worse. Some random shit like queen six suited, which I don't even know if it's a bluff, queen deuce suited, fucking ace four suited, I guess. It's kind of just wrapped around value here. Like there's very few like bluff hands. Um, ace king is pure checking here because it has some EV to check uh, regardless of the combination. Well, that was an interesting hand. Uh, we obviously, I assume we played it fine, actually. Did we, I, I assume we pure call ace queen suited. Of course we do. We actually beat value, theoretically. So that's absolutely fine. We open middle position, small blind three bets. We defend. We're actually having a little bit of four betting, but I'm not four betting that much in position. So we call. Jack of diamonds, 10 of spades, two of spades. Villain bet small, we pure call. Never actually raising this combo. Turn four of clubs. Villain bets big. They had ace queen in this hand. Ace queen offsuit. I'm not sure of the combo. Um, I can't remember. I think they had a spade in their hand. And it's always betting when they have the queen of spades. And I assume we're primarily calling ace 10 suited. Starting to fold, but not. And then the river was a brick. And villain jams ace queen, which is doing some of the time um, for about half part. And once we've called turn, we're primarily calling river, zero EV hand. But we called and beat the ace queen.